happens and you want us to join you live and everyone is going to get the answer. Hello, can I do some people inviting your followers? Hello, Kalicia. Hello, Dana. Hello, Shivara. Thank you so much. I finally finished it yesterday. I really can't miss I have to go back and um watch the sermon girl. I fell asleep. I fell asleep, but I hopped up out of this bed and started dancing. And that music went off, I tell you that, and he was speaking stuff, but yeah, I fell asleep. So I'm gonna have to go back. Hey beauty. Alright, so this is gonna be real quick. Everybody else can just catch the replay. I wanted to split and this is gonna be so short, but I wanted to split the the last scope I did up. I wanted it to be apart from this one just because I don't want us to get even though the Lord is saying a lot of great things and he is releasing a lot and some of us have suffered so bad. I had to get that out of the way. Yeah. Yeah. Some of us have suffered so long, like we're really in a season where God is gonna be releasing stuff back to back to back to back. I don't want us to get so thank you for the heart so caught up in that that we um forget that God is still gonna check us when we need to be checked. Okay. So that's why I wanted to split the two scopes up and focus on, you know, Holy Spirit with the other one and how we can't ignore him or put our leaders above him and then go back to what he said this morning about windows and doors. Okay. Hey, Alicia. So this morning, this morning while I was praying, doesn't he? he I mean, he'll check you. He'll check you. This morning while I was praying, at some point this morning, Holy Spirit let me know that I had been talking a lot about open. Uh oh. Can you hear me now? When I was praying this morning, Holy Spirit, volume is muffled. It shouldn't be muffled anymore. Okay. So I was praying this morning. Holy Spirit let me know that I was, I talked so much about or post about doors, 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 open doors. And I hear a lot of people talk about that. But he told me that I forgot about the windows, the open windows. So when he spoke that, I went to, just as a prophetic act, I went and laid hands on the windows in my hotel room and I started thanking God for opening the windows of heaven for every window he has opened for me um and, and poured blessings out upon so i'm going to read this scripture and a lot of times people use this scripture to scare people into paying tithes hey team to scare people into paying tithes but i really don't hear a lot of people talking about the windows being opened apart from just quoting this scripture to scare somebody to pay tithes so um the scripture is a Malachi 3 verse 10 bring ye all the tithes into the house that there may be meat in mine house and prove me now herewith said the Lord of hosts if I will not open the open you the windows of heaven and pour you out a blessing that there shall not be room enough to receive Malachi 3 and 10 so you can pray over it but listen not only do we have doors, open doors, and we're living under open heaven, there are windows that are open, and he wants us to acknowledge it. He wants us to pray it through. Thank you for the super hearts, Q and T. I pray the Lord blesses you abundantly a hundred times over. He wants us to clean these open doors, you all. So this is what you all need to do. Whenever you get some time, I dare you to lay hands on the windows in your house. And thank God for open doors. Just as a prophetic act, I believe in prophetic acts. Just as a prophetic act, go lay hands on the windows, the windows in your home. And I also came across a video that Yolanda Adams did where she was preaching or something. I came across that later this afternoon, way after he spoke that word to me. And she was preaching about the windows of heaven being open and what she she what she said was when you think about a window you think you're thinking about the window in your house she was like no god's window is way bigger than that she was like go look up at the sky that's the window of god she was like that's the window he has opened baby when i tell you i went to the window 
I look up at the sky and I thank God for the window of heaven being opened over me. So I encourage you to do that too. We don't just have open doors, but the windows are open as well. Windows and doors. He's pouring out blessings that we're not even going to have room enough to receive. And we're going to have to share with other people and so much to other people. Come on, somebody. So be fully encouraged. I speak it over everybody that's listening. Even now, let me see. Let's see if we're going. I speak open windows and doors over Q. Open windows and doors over Letitia. Open windows and doors over Tiara. Open windows and doors over Candace. Open windows and doors over Alicia. Open windows and doors over Alicia. Open windows and doors over Beauty. Open windows and doors over Dana. Open windows and doors over Shavana. Open windows and doors over Sabrina. Open windows and doors over Brittany. And open windows and doors over everybody. Listen, that's it. Over everybody that catches the replay, listen. Just remember to obey God in this season. Obey Him. The windows of heaven are open. He's opening doors. We're living under an open heaven. I mean, we just all messed up. You understand? Hello, Rashonda. I speak open windows and doors over Rashonda. Rashonda, catch the replay. I'm about to get off here. But listen, it is so, and it shall not be otherwise. Do you hear me? It is so. And it shall not be otherwise. You all keep me in your prayers. Pray for me, pray for me, pray for me. Oh, let's, while we're in this band, um, let's break off the spirit of delay. The spirit of delay and the spirit of sabotage. Because I know, I don't know about any of you, but with me, there's some things being held up. There's some stuff being held up. Um in the spirit realm some monies that are supposed to be released and all kind of stuff is happening but the devil is a whole liar listen open windows and doors over me i claim it the devil is a liar so we just break off the spirit of delay right now in the name of jesus we come against everything that's trying to hold up our harvest the devil is a liar lord we thank you for angels with swords of fire and buckets of blood to prevail over these demons even now in the name of jesus if there is anybody on this line that's listening live or catching the replay, God, I thank you that you break the spirit of delay off even now. God, we confuse the enemy even now in the name of Jesus. We ask you to send confusion and chaos in the enemy's camp. Let them turn on one another. Robo so. We decree and we declare that the heavens are open over us. We decree and declare that the windows are open over us. We decree and declare that you have opened doors that no man, no man, no witch, no warlock, <laughs> no Jezebel can shut. We decree it's open. We decree we're in our season of openness. Just open, 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 open. Somebody type it on the screen. It's just open. These harvests will come forth in the name of Jesus. God, everything that's holding up our harvest, we ask you to let it die by fire even now. Die by fire even now. Die by fire even now. God, your word says whenever the thief comes and robs us, they have to pay seven times. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven times more than what they stole and we claim that even now in the name of jesus we command the enemy to cough up our treasures cough up our stuff everything he stole from us we claim it back we snatch it back in the spirit right now god we claim it even now we thank you that we're going to see your hand even on tomorrow god the last Work day of the week, we're going to see your hand. We thank you for the suddenlies of God. We thank you for rapid releases. We thank you for accelerated harvest. We thank you for manifestations. We thank you that it's in our hands. It's in our hands even now. We thank you that it's in our hands even now. And we flow in the river of God. Satan, we plead the blood of Jesus against you. The Lord rebuke thee. 
every demon and every devil the lord rebuke thee the blood of jesus over our finances the blood of jesus over our bank accounts the blood of jesus over our purses the blood of jesus over our wallets the blood of jesus over our checkbooks the blood of jesus over our debit cards we plead the blood of jesus oh it's like i can see chains chains coming off of our finances even now god we thank you for breakthrough in our finances raman this these sudden i mean sudden demonic attacks as it relates to finances the devil is a liar he's a liar and he's a loser he is a defeated foe and God, we thank you that right now you're flexing on our behalf. God, we thank you that right now you are flexing. God, we knew you were going to do it. You're flexing on our behalf right now in the name of Jesus. God, show yourself mighty and show yourself strong. We call on Jehovah Gabor even now. Raman so koye le be she a raba so ya robo so koye le be she a raman so ya God you are mighty we don't magnify our problems we magnify you we don't magnify our lack we magnify you we don't magnify our bills we magnify you we don't magnify any worries that the devil is trying to bring in we magnify you for you are high and lifted up and your train fills the temple oh God rebe she a raman so who is like the Lord nobody. Is there anything too hard for God? God, we know that there's nothing too hard for you. So we thank you even now for a swift shift. A swift shift. A swift shift in our finances even now. A swift shift in our finances even now in the name of Jesus. Rabba Soya. Raman so koye rebe she a raba so ya. A swift shift, a swift shift, a swift shift. We decree and declare that it is so, and it shall not be otherwise. I even speak miracle money be placed in bank accounts even now. In the name of Jesus, ro koye rebe she a raba so ya. Raman so koye rebe she a raba so ya. 